Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a low fat, high protein, moderate carb pizza. Okay, it's a chicken and a bacon melt. And all you're going to need is some Domino, so I'm going to use 30 grams of this, fat free cheese, I'm going to use uh, 50 grams of that. I've got some cooked chicken already in there, and I'm going to use some turkey bacon as well. Okay, and we're gonna put this together, we're gonna put this meal together in three, two, one, let's go do this. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna cook off our turkey bacon, okay, because we've already got the cooked chicken here, okay. All I've done is I've just heated it back up in the microwave, so I've got 180 grams there of cooked chicken. Okay, so now we're going to get our little flatbread and all we're going to do is we're going to stick it in the grill. Roughly for about two minutes, flip it over and then do another minute so it browns off slightly. But you've got to keep an eye on it so it doesn't go burnt. Okay, so this one's all done now. As you can see, it's gone fairly harder. So, there's my sauce. I've weighed everything out. My turkey bacon, I've even just cut it up into little pieces. I've weighed out my cheese and obviously we've got our chicken there as well. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to build this pizza. Okay, this is the fun part now. What you got to do is just sauce over the top, okay? Remember, make sure you weigh your ingredients out to see if it can fit your macros. And what we're going to do is just put the sauce over. Just get it all over the top. Like so. So it comes out like so. Excuse my messy kitchen. Okay, and then you're gonna put a tiny bit of cheese, only a little bit. Just gonna put it over the top bottom, just so it sticks basically all the meat together. Okay, so then all you're gonna do after this is you're gonna place your chicken around like so. Okay, and we're gonna keep building it until we've built the pizza. Okay, so now as you can see, we've got all the toppings on top of the pizza. So now what we're gonna do is just gonna put the rest of the cheese all over the top. Okay, try and get it all over the whole of the pizza. Okay, so as you can see, all loaded up. So now what you're going to do is you're going to stick this thing back in the grill. So you're only going to need about two minutes, but you just keep an eye on it, okay? You do not want this thing burning, because this thing's going to go so fast once it's under this grill. Okay, so what we're going to do is just place the thing back under the grill. Okay, and then we're going to wait about two minutes, okay? But we're going to keep an eye on it. Okay, so we've had about two minutes now, okay? Um, I've just been keeping an eye on this thing. But there we go. As you can see, oh, go, careful, don't fall off. It's actually come out like a chicken and bacon melt. That you get from Domino's as well. Surprising that, isn't it? Okay, so in this actual pizza, okay, the macros for it are going to be just there for you, okay? Now, if you go to Pizza Hut, you go to Domino's, this one pizza here will be about 2,500 calories, maybe more, okay, because of all the fat content and everything like that, okay, but if you make it like this, you're going to make it much easier, okay, so that is how you make one of these, nice, simple, easy, okay, so keep an eye out for my YouTube, I'm doing vlogs, I've got a vlog coming up as well, so if you want to see any more footage like this, like, subscribe, bell button, I'm doing recipes, I'm doing workout tips, I'm taking you through my day sometimes, but yeah, remember, like, subscribe, bell button, I'll see you in the next one.